what is going on everybody it's your boy j michael welcome or welcome back to another weekly vlog this is something different y'all know i usually don't stop my vlogs up on sunday but we got some stuff that's going on today so i decided why not vlog it because well i feel like i've been such a bad vlogger i've been so inconsistent on youtube i am behind about three videos yeah and i also have a video to edit for my mother so we have our work cut out for this week because not only do i have to edit and try to upload all this stuff i have um a zoom call i have a show this week work i mean <laughs> we're gonna be busy this week it is currently 12:03, as you can see well I don't have my clothes on anymore, but we just came back from church maybe about 15, 20 minutes ago. I got some pictures today, so I did post those. Make sure y'all go to my Instagram, at jmichael, and go like those. Because, I mean, I hate when my phone started doing stuff like this. Like, why aren't you turning it on? If you haven't already, go like those those pictures. Because, I mean, it, it's a cute little, cute little Sunday moment, right? 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 The caption is kind of, uh, not kind of, it is something that the pastor preached about today, but... If you read the caption, you'll probably get a little bit out of it, but whatever, we're not gonna go um, that route today. I am about to change my clothes, go get my car wash, because later on tonight, me and my mom are going to a sneaker ball. So I'm gonna try to figure out what I'm gonna wear because I have no idea, but I really wanna get my car out the way first and then come back here, do everything I gotta do. I wanna at least try to get half of a video edited. Like I just, this past week has been so busy, so stressful. Wow. Her mouth, Nevaeh's mouth is so big. Oh my gosh. This past week has just been so stressful. Some stuff I can't talk about, um, but you know, I've had rehearsals and all the other jazz and conference calls and I'm just all over the place, okay? What's going on y'all? So I literally just left the car wash and let me tell y'all something. I just love having a clean car. Something about just getting your car clean every Sunday. I don't know, just do something to me. Just start your week off good with a clean car. You know, that way when I go to work tomorrow, I get in my car. It's just a, I don't know, it's like I feel like I got a new car. <laughs> Comment down below if you like that. Like when you wash your car, you feel like you, you got a new car. Like maybe I'm just crazy. Anyways, I am on my way to, I'm sorry about the lighting y'all, this stupid backlighting, the sun is behind me. I'm on my way to pick up some food. I'm going to get some tropical smoothie. I already ordered it, so I just got to go in there and pick it up. I feel like that's way quicker, and when I go in there and I order, I be seeing people do that all the time. I'm like, dang, I could have just walked in here and just got it and been on about my day. So that's exactly what I'm doing today. I get a kiwi quencher and now I have been getting a wrap, the Caribbean jerk chicken wrap. Yeah, and it's so good, y'all so good i figure eat now because y'all know i'm going out later and that way when i get back i could just have what my grandma's cooking which is you know the usual chicken and rice so yeah i'm ready for thanksgiving though speaking of food because i want some macaroni and cheese i should have asked my mom what to make it today really what's up y'all so if y'all have passed by i'm home all the good stuff and i'm trying to find an outfit to wear for tonight right right i pretty much found an outfit it's nice or whatever but the pants are way too big i got it from my mom like literally they're safety pinned right now yeah so i'm gonna tailor them because not only is the waist too big but i just want them to fit a little better and kind of flare out at the bottom i feel like that'll be really nice i don't have a pair of like flared leathers so i feel like i can i could maybe do something do something with these i'm gonna get back in my song bag i have not sold anything in so long so we're gonna see how how this turns out. Last time I talked to y'all, I was trying to DIY some pants. Yeah, I didn't do that. I didn't even feel like doing it. After I turned the camera off, I was like, do I really want to do this? And the answer was no. I have no idea why that glare is there. It's never there, usually. So I'm just gonna stand right here. Anyways, I'm about to put on my clothes. The outfit is real cute, real chill. This is a sneaker ball, all black attire. So you have to wear Jordan ones and wear all black. I got like this cute, this reminds me of like a Chanel inspired look, right? So this cute Chanel inspired vest. This is from Zara. I picked this up when I was in the LA. The last time I was in LA, 
in September with this black turtleneck. This is from ASOS, I believe. Either ASOS or H&M. I was gonna either do these leather pants or these flowy pants. These are minimal. These are from PacSun. And then the Jordans I will be wearing are these Jordan 1s, my patent leather ones. These are like probably one of my favorite pair of Jordan 1s. And then I'm gonna do this gold, black and gold um, Dolce & Gabbana bag. Super duper cute, nice and dainty, and the gold hardware matches the vibe of the vest. Y'all know I'm all about the details. Like, y'all see like what I was going for? How like the vibes kind of match, so. Yeah, I have not decided. <gasps> oh my God, it's a spider. <laughs> ah, there you go, the battle. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, uh, <laughs> oh my gosh, uh, that spider trying to get me. I tried killing it, it's gonna fall. Oh my, okay. <sighs> Anyways, I don't even know what I was saying. <sighs> <sighs> let me get ready. <laughs> let, let me, let me turn my music back on and let me get ready. I just. It's beauty and the struggle, ugliness and the success. Let's say y'all, so I'm back. <laughs> After my little um spider episode, I'm back, right? So I decided to go with the leather pants. I hate how the lighting is. Like, I'm sorry, y'all. Probably looks better than it does on my little itty bitty camera, but whatever. I did decide to go with the leather pants. Mm. 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 Leather pants. I don't know. I just feel like it brought more character. And then instead of doing a turtleneck, I did my mesh shirt under it, my or two mesh shirt, because I just, I don't know. I feel like it just added more edge to the outfit, you know? Yeah, I'm gonna change my bags over. Oh, over now. Then I'm gonna give y'all another full OOTN outfit of the night. This little tidbit, little fun fact for, you know, my bag lovers. Stuff your bags with dust bags because it will help keep it shape, especially when it comes time, like if you ever want to sell your bag. It just, it makes the whole process so much easier because like your bag is in good condition, it's in decent shape. Don't nobody want to buy no bag or don't nobody want to have no bag that's just all bent up and all out of shape. Like... Nobody, nobody wants that. Alpha of the night, okay? So, we have an all black ensemble going on. Y'all know the deal? Uh, uh. We're gonna start from top to bottom. Glasses. These are some um, fake. I, I forgot what they used to call these glasses, but yeah, everybody used to wear them back in the day, like 2016, 2017. Yeah, so I have these on. These are from ASOS. I tried to link them down below, but I got them years ago, so I highly doubt they still have them. Zara. Um, Sheer shirt or two, bad doche, pants minimal, shoes, Jordans, y'all know the deal. Um, yeah, scent of the night. Let's go ahead and put on my citizen jack because I'm gonna be around people. I'm about to head out. Outfit's looking good. I look cute. I'm probably just gonna fix my hair up a little bit, and that's that. So, yeah, if I'm gonna talk to y'all anymore tonight, I just see y'all tomorrow. So, yeah, let's go have some fun. Good morning, everybody. So it's the next day, and I am all ready for work. I'm about to put my socks and shoes on so we can get this day started. Today, I won't be coming right home after work. I'm going off to Richmond, driving up to see Alden. I need my hair cut, and I want him to cut my hair. Plus, we want to see his new place. So that's going to be done after work. But other than that, today's just going to be a normal, regular day. Uh, my lunch is all packed downstairs. I got my shades. I really have everything. I'm ready for work early, surprisingly. It's 7.47. I'm like almost 15 minutes early. No, a little less than 15 minutes. But regardless, I'm ready early. Yeah, I'm finna sit here, chill out, relax until it's time for me to... I mean, I might as well just go put on my shoes now. By the time I do all that, it's time for me to go. So, yeah. Let's get this work day started. Yes. <laughs> 
I skipped out. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, turn around and let me see that sexy body go bum bum bum. Popping y'all, so I'm happy. Why? Because we're off for work. Absolutely. As you can see, I got some different clothes on. I'm not wearing my work clothes. First of all, let's talk about work, okay? Work was so chill today, so smooth. I love days like this when, like, either they need help up front because that means that I don't have to work in the back and I can just sit up front. And honestly, if we be honest, on uh, slow days, I'd rather sit up in the front, check people in, you know, help them figure out what the, what they got to do because, um, yeah, I'm just not a, if it's a light day, like what I'm finna do. No, I wanna let me check people in. So that's what I was doing today, helping people check in and all that good stuff. So work was really, really chill. I maybe only saw, well, my first patient canceled. Well, not canceled, he was a no-show. I only had like one patient today. Um, we had a working interview today and working interviews are pretty much what um, this is what I did my first I call that my first day there You know you come in and you pretty much work as an interview and I got paid for mine So yeah, all dentists don't do that, but luckily mine is very very generous luckily. Yeah, right now though. We are on the way to Nick's house because um, We are taking a little trip up to Richmond for a few hours because one I need my hair cut and I want Alan to cut my hair and um, Two Nick, Nick is not gonna be here for much longer. So we're just trying to do stuff. Okay We're just trying to do stuff trying to have fun. So we're gonna make a, a nice little trip out of this All right, y'all. So it's for y'all not about an hour and a half later. Um, we made it to Richmond. I got Fran with me Fran with me Fran with me. Where, where? It's just the web. I was gonna say something uh, oh, yeah, that's what I was tripping at first. All right, let's get these pictures done. For some this look like over here, right? Because this gives like. Yeah, low key give like street, definitely. What are those shoes? They're Nike, what? Martin and Rose clap. Are they, they're heels? Yeah. Oh, they are like really. Okay, yeah. Okay. That's better. Yeah. You think it gave this vibe or should I go on the street? Mmm. I feel like if we could get the yellow in it, it would give this vibe. Oh, you wanna do against the wall? Or not against the wall, but let's offset something. That if you put your foot on that. This? Yeah, try that. Whatever pose you were doing before. You like that? I just Or you think it's too grunge? It might be too grunge, because like I wanted to give grunge, but not really grunge. It is not cold out here, Nick. Don't play, it's really friend. Warm right now, I'm about boy. to start shit. You don't got nothing to say? <laughs> you not gonna, you not gonna speak to my peoples? Hey, how y'all? I was about to say, don't be rude. Don't be rude now. We're playing a game, y'all. Hey, we gonna guess the same time? Yeah. Oh, okay. You? It was your idea. <laughs> okay. okay. Is it out of a specific like? No. Set. Just, well, nigga, any number it was shit. Right. Three, two, one, Eight. Seven. Uh, Color. Okay. Three, two, one. Red, purple. Zaxby's makeup. Boy, what? I thought it was uh, much. Okay. <laughs> Shape. Three, two, one. Triangle. Alden, right, what did you get? <laughs> not, <laughs> not a diagonal thing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
All right, y'all, so a few hours have passed by since the last time I've spoken to y'all. Like, I, I don't even think I've spoken to y'all today, but yeah. As you can see, the lights are up. I'm about to hop on a Zoom call, actually, like, in 10 minutes. <laughs> so I took a shower. My face is a little ashy because I didn't get a chance to, like, wash it and do all the good stuff. But I took a shower, washed my hair, threw something on real quick, and I'm about to get on this Zoom call. This is my first time having a Zoom call in here with the new room set up. And I'm not gonna lie, it's definitely giving what it's supposed to give. Definitely, like. Like, it's definitely let me let me let me show y'all what's tea like come on now with the chanel in the back you can't tell me that this ain't five like if you didn't know this is my zoom setup now it is it wasn't always like this but <sighs> yeah ooh, ooh, ooh. yeah um extremely tired today very 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 tired i should have known better to go out twice in a row knowing i got work the day after like i just yeah, so um, I'm very tired. After my break today at work, I definitely was like nodding off low-key. Definitely, definitely, but you know, it is what it is. Let me turn on this AC because um, it's very hot in here. I haven't filmed with lights in a minute or I haven't had lights beaming at me in a minute, so I forgot how hot they can get. And it's definitely giving toasty, you know? Grams is downstairs making my food now. Very excited about that. So yeah, we're gonna eat good tonight. Once I'm done with this Zoom call, I'm gonna get started on show prep for tomorrow um it's really not like a show it's more like a showcase a competition type of thing my dancers are on the way to my house now to pick up their clothes i actually have dj on standby because they said they're on the way now and i'm about to hop on a zoom call hello i'm about to hop on a zoom call soon okay but i need to go to the store in your car the way okay hi hi how are you i'm fine how are you also fine. Thank you for asking. <laughs> looks like it's been, it looks like it's sunny. Where are you? You're on the east coast. Is it still light out? No, it's my light. <laughs> it's good. It's good. You gotta go. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> um, it's very nice to meet you. Yes. Uh, thank you for jumping on with me. Um, as I said in the email, I work with um, who I know you already know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're looking to sort of crack the code on this idea of. What's up, y'all? So, a few hours have passed by. Your boys all chopped and screwed, done cut my hair, yada, yada, yada. But I'm about to start getting ready for bed and get ready for my day tomorrow. A little stressed out because I'm going to be rushing. Like, I don't know what when I get off of work so I can make it in time for a possible sound check. But I just wanted to show y'all the fit because I highly doubt that I have time to do all this tomorrow. My dancers, what I'm going to start doing is getting all my dancers clothes from Shein because one, it's cheaper. And two, they have some really good quality stuff. I personally haven't shopped on Shein for myself probably since the pandemic. Maybe that's probably the last time. I shot that she in the pandemic. I got these cute solid black y'all know black is my thing when I perform black tops with sparkly fringe on them I thought this was so neat y'all I actually have um I don't my other show clothes are in my closet but I have actually bought two other things because I wasn't originally gonna wear what I'm wearing tomorrow this is what both of my dancers are wearing both of those are in a medium when i tell you this quality is good it's good so they're gonna do this with black suit pants and some air jordan ones i am doing these silky or be satin rather black pants they flare at the bottom these are from boohoo my whole outfit is from boohoo this satin tiger print blazer it's a double breasted blazer and since my dancers have um the sparkles in their shirt i'm gonna do this underneath my blazer now i don't know if i'm gonna do this or actually i might do this and turn it backwards actually that way it's more of a mock neck or scoop neck rather i don't know i don't know if the v-neck is gonna look right because i have a i don't know we're gonna have to see if i don't I have another sparkly shirt um i'm gonna do this to kind of intermingle with sparkles in their shirt you see you see you see you see the vibe that i'm going for i'm super excited can't wait to you know put on the show Good morning, everybody. So it's the next day, and I am all ready for my show tonight. Today is going to be low key a little stressful. They didn't tell me until yesterday 
that you need to be there by 5 o'clock for sound check. I get off at 4.30. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to try to figure something out because not only do I have to come all the way back, which is about a 30 minute drive after work with traffic, I gotta get ready and then I have to head to Portsmouth. So I'm, this is so unorganized <laughs> because I feel like that should have been one of the first things that, that I was told, like, okay, this is what time you should be here for sound check. Like if I didn't ask, I wouldn't know anything, you know? So. It is what it is, whatever. Yeah, I'm on my way to work right now. I had an amazing night of sleep. Slept so good, y'all. Like, oh my goodness, I slept so good. Yeah, that's that. Nothing really going on right now. Um, I'm just ready for my show tonight. Ready for this work day to pass by. Really wish I didn't come to work today. But um, I'm already taking off. Not next week, but the week after next. I still want my check to look juicy. And I can't look juicy if I'm just taking off of work all the daggone time. So, we on the way to work. Hope you guys are all having a wonderful morning, day, evening, morning, noon, night, wherever you are in this world, uh, whatever time you are watching. I just hope that you are just having a good and bright and jolly good time. Yeah, I'm gonna get back to listening to my music and I will chit chat with y'all later on today when I'm on my way home. What's up, y'all? So, it is a few hours later. Much, much later, actually. Last time I talked to y'all was definitely early in the morning. It is show day, as you guys know, and I'm actually getting ready to head out now. Um, I just have to run back upstairs for my camera and my laptop and stuff so they can play my music, but I'm excited. We're gonna make this thing happen. Show them what we made of, so, yeah. Let's head on over and get this thing on the road. Good morning, everybody. So it's the next day. I know yesterday ended a bit abruptly, so let me just catch y'all up on speed on everything that went down, okay? So first and foremost, I'm getting ready for work. Obviously got the Janu scrubs on. I am about to do my hair real quick. I just realized that when I cut it the other day, I didn't put any essential oils in it. So today I'm gonna do um, the hair scalp oil with saw, palmetto, Jamaican black castor oil, and grapeseed oil. I'm talking kind of fast because I have to leave in 10 minutes, but yeah. Um, I'm gonna put this on my head and y'all know the the usual curl a la stuff that I use along with my sponge and Yesterday when I arrived to the casino, right 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 Long story short, they didn't let your boy <laughs> They didn't let me in because I'm not 21 Um, which is crazy because like I've been many casinos before without being asked how old I was or whatever Then again, that was Vegas. Vegas is a totally different ball game to Virginia Yeah, so they didn't let me in but it wasn't just that you know, I was very irritated about that, but I'll, I'll get into that. It was really the people out front, right? So it was this black lady. She was just so mean and nasty to my mother. Like, we told her, like, yeah, well, he's performing. Oh, oh, I guess he ain't performing today. He ain't 21, so we can't get him. Just being so rude and nasty. Me and my mom at this point know what it is when people are trying to figure out who we are. They usually look at me first, and then I'm the confirmation that she is who she is. So I had my, you know, my tail for our Uggs on, and I noticed she's sizing me up and down which is one of the things that people do you know she's like i like your uggs i simply just stared at her because one i'm on the phone and two lady you was just being so rude and nasty to us i don't want no compliment as we're leaving out i hear her ask oh my god is that coco is that coco and she wants to try to get a picture lady you was just being rude and nasty to us so rude so nasty keep it like that don't change your tone don't change the motion in your ocean because you found out that the lady is being rude to is a celebrity somebody you probably listened to when you was growing up don't do that because that ain't right like nobody's saying pulling strings or anything like that because i mean if i can't get in i can't get in don't be rude because if you're rude to us i can only imagine how rude you are to other people you know that's why i always say just treat people with respect treat people how you would want to be treated because you never know who's connected to who you never know who is like who somebody is you never know i was really upset initially but you know as i went home and i started thinking about everything i was like you know what that was just for the best this competition won't for me no ways you can read between the lines if you want yeah i was just like you know what whatever on to bigger and better things all of a sudden everybody went bang with us don't they know them god kids are dangerous Come, come now, y'all need to stop Niggas better hold their head for their body rock I got soldiers in every town That'll come for y'all like black or down I ain't playing with you motherfuckers What's up y'all? So we're at work. I just finished my first patient. I'm actually about to go walk my second patient back here. Set up for a crown delivery. About to get that on them popping. Yeah, just wanted to check in with y'all, say hi, cause I really ever taught y'all to work anymore. He's a movement, fight for the cause. Got a fight that's bigger than yours. With the without my boys, I still make noise. Can we say, that's when y'all turn it up. Can we say, that's when y'all burn it up. I'm doing. I ain't losing 
in my mind. I'm just so advanced, I'm ahead of my time. You hold stuck at the back, I'm ahead of the line. Ah. Even in the dark, I'm still gonna shine. You'll see what I mean in 2009. I kick out a space rap. What to do, y'all? So, I'm spraying some air freshener in my car. I'm actually about to head over and go pick my father up. We're going out to dinner. So, yeah, we're gonna meet. I'm gonna meet up with him. Not really meet up with him. Go pick him up because he asked me to pick him up. I'm gonna go pick him up and we're gonna go eat. I'm starving like Marvin. Like, I'm. S Jasmine! I'm starving. Like, I'm so hungry. Like, I don't think y'all even understand the level of hungry I am right now. Let me head over there. I will chit chat with y'all sometime later. What's up y'all? So I am I'm on my way um, to my car actually. Just left yard house with daddy y'all. Food was good. I didn't eat all my food though cause I don't know. I just, I think I waited so long to eat. I just won't hungry no more so yeah. Um, dinner was good. I didn't really vlog while I was in there for real. Is this the level I'm on? I hate the fact that I don't ever remember where I parked at. I think this is the level of, no, I think I was on three. No, I'm right here. I go right here. <laughs> yeah, we was just having a good talk. I didn't really want to vlog. A few was having a good talk, so I didn't. Simple. I done had me a long day at work. I just want to relax. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I don't even think I'm going out this week. And you hear me? Because I simply, I'm just tired. I'm drained. I'm worn out. Like, and I got to save my energy for next weekend. Anyways, because I'm supposed to be going out of the town. So, yeah, we're going to cross that bridge when we get up. All right, y'all. So I'm home. And guess what came? My package. And I'm happy. I'm so happy because this is the stuff that I'm supposed to be wearing on this upcoming little trippy trip. I say trip like I don't go like the same two or three places every time I'm like traveling. But still, I'm going on a trip. I hope this stuff fits. If not, I will go to the tailors tomorrow while I'm out because I'll be over there actually. So it actually came in perfect timing because yes, yes, yes. If y'all know I love me a good set. Okay. I, come on. I love me a good set and look at this. Oh my gosh. Do y'all see this? The print is giving. It's giving. So it's like a three piece set, right? So the pants and then you got the jacket. What size did I get the jacket in? A medium? Ooh. Low key, I should've got a large. Have it like low key oversized, but this is the jacket and then the bucket hat that I hope looks good on me. I used to wear bucket hats all the time in middle school. If you know, you know. But <laughs> I used to wear bucket hats all the time. I just hope like it looks right on me. Oh yeah. I think it looks cute. I don't know, we can make it work. I'm not a bucket hat wearer, so yeah, but we, we gonna make it work. So we gonna try that on. Y'all don't need to see how it looks on. Not yet. And then I got a suit, baby. Okay, no, let me open up the pants first. Ooh, this is darker than I thought it was gonna be. Hold up. Cause the shoes I got this for. Hold up. Let me see. Uh-uh. Ow. Nah. Cause this is what I really got the shoes for or the suit for to try to match these shoes. But I could also do these cause I'm not sure if, I don't know. I might have to pop out with these though. I don't know. We gonna see, we gonna see. Okay, anyways, it comes with pocket chain. I absolutely love that trend of putting pocket chains on the suit. This is the jacket. Ooh, I love the hardware looks so much better in person. And I love this material. This is, the jacket, I'm gonna try that on. Also, I think I'll probably, I don't know. We're gonna see what shoe I'll go with. Who knows? We'll see. I might have to bring both, but yeah. 
This is the suit. That's the set. I'm going to try the stuff on because y'all don't need to see how it looks on yet. I don't have to wait another week. What's going on y'all? So it is the next day and I'm currently at the Mercedes dealership trying to get my car serviced but this line is so crazy. I have never seen a line at the Mercedes dealership before when it comes to get my car serviced. I've came many times early in the morning because I like to get it out the way, you know? So we're gonna see what this is giving. It's only one line open so maybe that's why. Only one garage is open. After I leave the service department, I'm going to go straight to the mall because I need to pick up some more Citizen Jack and I'm gonna go to y'all know my favorite favorite fragrance kiosk in La Haba Mall. I don't know the name of it which is crazy. It's my favorite spot in the mall and I don't even know the name of it. <laughs> I don't even know if they have a name. We're gonna go there today and that's pretty much it. I really want to get some editing done today though. But they ain't blocked me in them. All right, y'all, so we are indeed not getting our car service anymore today. And I'm not even tripping. I don't even care. I had an appointment at 9.30. Mind you, they were slammed. I told y'all it was a line today. It was slammed packed. I had an appointment at 9.30. I had a whole situation this morning, really last night, where I couldn't find my key that I was using, the key that worked. I have two keys. One stopped working because I needed a battery. The other one was still working, so I just put it off, get new batteries, but I lost the one that was working. So this morning, I had to wake up, go out to the store, run and find some batteries. I went to one store thinking that they would have the batteries, but they didn't. So I went to a store I knew that actually had the batteries and got them and came back home. By the time I got back home, it was like 8, 8.40 something, almost 8.50. I got here at 10 something and um, yeah, they were like, pretty much I missed my appointment. It was so busy, it was so packed. It was like that if I just wanted to do express, like I guess like walk in and just get it done. It was like six, seven hours. I'm sorry, I said I was gonna wait, but I'm not waiting no six, seven hours. That's that's pushing it. That's a whole work shift. I'm not doing that. So we're just gonna head straight to the mall, spend some money, make me feel happy. <laughs> I will, you too, and I'm sorry about your dog. Yeah. H&M done. Let's go to the fragrance kiosk. Okay, I'm back. Oh, baby. <laughs> I'm good. Okay. So you can put your stuff here with your friend. Do you mind if I start to? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. I love it because it's sea salt, it's vanilla and champagne. Mmm. This is good. This one is actually berry, strawberry, and uh, cream. Mm. Now I want to bring the big guns now. <laughs> I am telling you. This is so nice. You said this is a buckle? Buckle. Oh wow. Here is so small, so good, and vanilla and sweet. I and love all. vanilla sweets. And... Have to go with you. Oh yeah. It's have to be. And look to this version. What do you can do? Oh That's yeah. Extra. So literally, you saved six hundred dollars. Oh wow. How <laughs> Thank you. We love you, sweetie. Thank you. Till next time. Next time is just hot and shine like a diamond. Thank you. You uh, too. Y'all. <laughs> I, has, I just spent so much money on fragrances, y'all. I want to say shout out to y'all, first of all, because I don't, sometimes I just underestimate, you know, my supporters or whatever the case may be, but the lady told me that so many people come by, they talk about me, they love me. So that means that y'all are actually paying attention and y'all are actually going to certain places that I recommend. I'm like, oh my God, that's so crazy to me. She said that people come by all the time, they bring me up, they love me. She even had to go look me up herself and all that stuff. She gave me, she, I just, this is why I love going there, okay? When you shop somewhere so much like a fragrance store you become a VIP member when you spend as much money as I done spent at these stores you become a VIP member and she gave me so many goodies y'all y'all know I must have some fragrances it just doesn't make sense why I use so much to wait until I get to the last itty bitty drops of my fragrances to go get some more like no so yeah I got a lot oh my gosh I got like two in this bag one is I gotta show y'all the box. I gotta do them boxing, but this bag has all the goodies. I have one, two, three, four, five, six big ones. Three oils, a uh, big old box of samples. Like, if you are in the 757, like I always say, make sure you go to Perfume Addict. It's over there on the side H&M is. Go there. I I'm telling you. Go there and tell her that J. Michael, her favorite bougie customer sent her, because that's what she called me. She always say I'm so bougie. Tell her that her favorite bougie customer sent you to her. All right, y'all. So we home, so we can get into this haul. From H&M, I pretty much got mostly essentials. Y'all know I love me 
a good black and white tee, okay? So I got three, was it three or four? Three white tees, three black tees. I really like H&M's basics. They have really, really good basics. I get my... Bro, these curve at the bottom. Do these both curve at the bottom? Okay, well, um, these all curve at the bottom. I didn't realize that in H&M, so these are going back. I don't like no shirts that curve at the bottom. <laughs> Absolutely not. We're going to take these back and get the regular shirts that, you know, are just straight across the bottom. H&M was having a sale. Y'all know I love me a sale. Okay, so I got this cute shirt. I saw this in H&M a few months ago. I didn't care to buy it. It was only $7.99. So I was like, why not? I like the colors and I need more colors in my closet. And then I got this bomb jacket. I haven't tried this on, but I just feel like it's going to fit me real good. When I was in Forever 21, I saw this two-piece set it was like nylon material nylon denim or something like that it was really nice i should have got that too it went really nice with this right here now to what really matters <laughs> this is patek mason marakai she was i don't know how to say these names y'all she was saying them all nice and pretty and i was like girl you she got that accent i, I can't roll my r's i can't do none of that stuff so yeah and the boxes that i'm a box guy okay the box the presentation, it just has to be there. Y'all are a little crooked. Hold up. Yeah, the presentation has to be top tier. If it's not top tier, I'm not even interested. Let's see which one this was. Some of these I can't remember. That's right. Okay. I feel like I've seen Peyton Charles talk about this one right here, if I'm not mistaken. But when I smelled this one, I was like, oh, yes. Oh, it smells so good. Where's the front? Oh, it smells so good. This has like the perfect balance between like sweet but spicy at the same time. I love me a good spice. Okay, yeah, like I was saying, this is like the perfect mix of sweet and spicy. Yeah, we love this one right here. I'm gonna just put them back in their boxes until I put them up, you know. Mm -hmm. This one right here, called Yara, she said that I can pretty much mix this with like any type of fragrance I want. Any, any type of fragrance. Look at this. The bottle is so pretty. And it smells so good. Then y'all know my usuals. Well, this is a new one, but my usual Citizen Jack. I don't have to show y'all that one. I did get Visionary Midnight Blue. This is kind of like Visionary Indigo, but in my opinion, just a bit lighter. A bit lighter. Still smells really, really good though. I still prefer Visionary Indigo over this. Like that one's just more richer to me, you know. So these were gifts that she just gave to me. So she gave me um, the samples for Patek Mason Prime Collection. That's the collection I got this from. Yeah, it... I just love fragrances. And then she gave me some oils. Been wanting to get into oils. So she gave me Why Men. But it smells good. It's given, use this as a base and put this over this. Hold up, let me find out I don't have to get in oils. I used to wear oils all the time in middle school. I don't know why I stopped. This one is Valentino. Y'all know I love me some Valentino. And this is Creed. I don't know if this is the Creed I used to have. Then we got one more box. Last two. This one is another Patek Mason one. Okay, Luminous Norm. Yeah. It smells so good. Anything Nora I love. I actually might make this one of my staples when I go on my trip next weekend. This smells really, really, really good. Oh my gosh. And then we got this big boy right here. This big boy right here. So she said this one is a, what did she say? This one was a Dubai one? It was either this one or this one. She said like they had just got licensed in the US to start selling these here. I don't know, something like that. But we got this one right here and I really got this because of the box. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but I did. And I am keeping the box, like be for real. I kind of showed y'all this when I was at the kiosk, right? This is Encore. Look at this. Oh, look at this. And she said that this thing can come out and it's a buckle. I don't know how. But she definitely said that it can come out and it's like a whole buckle. We're going to see how we can do that. But this is Encore. I'm definitely keeping this box. I'm sorry. I have to. And it smells so good. Ooh, it's kind of reminiscent of this one. But I don't know. It has more of a muskier smell. Mm. Oh my gosh. That's a little haul from the mall today. I just, uh, I'm so happy that I have fragrances that I can now bounce back and forth between. Like, ugh. And I got my Citizen Jack. I got the original one because I didn't really like the 
new and improved one. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. I didn't really like that new and improved one. Mm -mm. I'm gonna put this stuff up, edit for the rest of the day. I don't really have anything else planned. Somebody was like, oh my God, are you okay? Where have you been at? It's almost been two weeks. Y'all, I've been working, okay? <laughs> so I'm gonna edit for the rest of the day and um, I'll see y'all y'all when I can. Thank mm -hmm. you.